Welcome, 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 welcome back to this week's cast of Revelation on the Word. I'm Pastor Rico Clayton. Want to welcome all of y'all in. Come in, come in, come in. Do come in and uh, talk to you, boy. Amen. Want to greet you all as usual in the name of Jesus. Uh, Want to say what's up to everybody. What's up to my church family, Facebook family, family down in Houston, everybody. I just want to say my YouTube subscribers, man. Thank y'all, all my donors. I love y'all. And I just want to get straight to my content. And this is what I want to talk about. Um, trust in God. Uh, we're getting to a point now where folk are just scoffing, man. They don't want to trust nothing or believe in anything. I believe in the good of mankind. And I'm here to tell you that there's good in every last one of us. Amen. But it's really learning to trust God. And here's the thing. Look at me. Look at me good today. He's proven himself to you, to me over and over again. I don't know how many times where I was in a situation where I was saying, Lord, if you could just get me out of this, Lord, if you could just help me pay this thing off, Lord, if you can move, move on this situation. And he actually did it. Uh, I'll use a better example. I remember when I was in the bars, I used to drink a lot and I, I probably had a drinking problem. Didn't even really know I had a drinking problem. And um, many a nights come home uh, drunk, hungover, inebriated, and uh, hugging the stool and begging God, Lord, if you just, uh, I promise you, I'll never drink again. To turn right around a few days later or the very next weekend, going right back to drinking. It was when I truly made up in my mind that, you know what, I'm going to really start trusting God because he's proven himself time after time after time after time. And I don't know who I'm talking to this morning, but I want to encourage you, man. Begin to trust God like you used to. Get back to your root, basic, gut, spiritual instinct. Amen. And I want you to know that God will do it for you. Let me give you some revelation. Proverbs chapter 3, verses 5 and 6 says, Trust in the Lord with all thine heart, and lean not to your own understanding. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he will direct all of your paths. Because it's plural in this, it's paths. He's going to direct your steps. And understand this. That leaning to the own understanding is the thing that gets us in trouble, man. How many times we said we thought we heard God and it really wasn't God. So I want you to get back to believing in God. We're going to have a good service today, man. I'm preaching today. Um, I can't remember. Uh, I'm preaching battle tested. Man, that's going to be like it. Y'all need to come on in here. 4473 Adams. Y'all know I love you. I'm on love. I'll talk to you soon. Take care. God bless.